Hey, it's your boy DJ Wolf here. I <clears throat> got a lot on my mind right now. Um, this mess of Ferguson, man, I, I'm telling you, it's it, it, here's my take on it. You have a officer who gets a response to a call by a young man who stole some cigars out of a store in Ferguson, Missouri. He roughhouses the store of Lloyd. He follows them directed to where they he, he really he finds out where they were at in the neighborhood. He stops them, tells them, get the F off the street. Right? Next thing you know, they scuffling, whatever, allegedly. Young boy runs, puts his hands up, officer shoots him. Roughly six times. How is it that an officer can shoot an unarmed suspect six times and walk away scot free? People don't even shoot dogs like that. The bottom line is, that was cold blooded murder. And then, the DA, I mean, you know, the courts talking about, oh, um, too many inconsistencies in the story. That's all the more reason you would actually go out and indict him. Because of all the inconsistencies in the story that need to be looked into and addressed so you can get the right story to come up with a proper proper conviction. It makes no sense to me. You know, this country is going ass backwards, man. In a handbasket, man. You know? And then the protesters start fighting, not all of them, and there were a number of protesters start throwing rocks and bottles at the cops. You know? As soon as the verdict it was handed over. <laughs> and my thing is you're doing that, starting fires, blowing up cars, police cars, and you think things gonna get better when you do that? Are you serious? You done made you done, you done, you done made things worse than what it is just by doing that. You know, I understand being upset about about uh, that decision. That's that decision was messed up. You know, and we're tired of it. This young people, this younger generation are high-headed as it is, you know, but at some point, you got to keep protesting, but you have to do it peacefully, because if you start throwing rocks and bombs at these cops, thinking that it's all the cops' fault, because it ain't all the cops' fault, it was one cop that did that, you know, and you're only making matters worse doing criminal things by trying to attack a person who did a criminal matter. That makes you just as bad as they are. It does. I'm sorry. I won't say that. You burn your own neighborhoods, and then you don't want people to come back and, oh, we need you to rebuild the neighborhoods after you messed them up. Seriously? Seriously. Give you something to chew on. DJ Wolf. By the way, I'm going, uh, uh, I plan on doing a special show on Ferguson, so stay tuned for that. Stay tuned. It may be tonight, but I'll let you know. I will be sending it out. Check out my show for all to hear with DJ Wolf. I will be sending you showtimes on it. DJ Wolf, out.